Hi, it's Guya Mike, and welcome to another video where I read one of your emails and give my opinion on the matter. So let's get straight into it. Dear Kuya Mike, I'm an older guy and has relative success and do okay for myself money-wise and with the girls who were younger than me. The girls I've been with recently seem to be with me because of what I can provide for them rather than me as a person. I think I'm a sugar daddy. The things I get for her seem to be getting more and more extravagant. Now don't get me wrong, the time in Pound Town is great and I'm willing to get to know her as I like her. I'm also willing to keep it just as f rabbits and keep it purely sexual. I just don't want to commit if she's just using me for my ham candle and my money. Should I confront her about it. Thanks. Yeah, so this email, straight to the point, it's great, pretty vague actually. Not a lot of backstory like a previous video, which is good in its own way because a lot more people can relate. So this situation where you feel that you are the sugar daddy and the gifts are getting more and more extravagant, I would say treat this like a band-aid. Just rip it off, get it over it and just say up to her straight up, hey, I want to know where this relationship is headed. If she panics, then you know what? Maybe she's just there for your ham candle and your wallet. If she actually says, yeah, I really like you and I can see something happening, you know, we have kids and stuff, then absolutely great. But do bear in mind, if this person is what you suspect her to be a gold digger, they can, I mean, you didn't say gold digger, did you? No, you didn't say gold digger, but you said sugar daddy, sugar daddy and gold digger, they usually go together. Yeah, if she is that, they can be pretty creative and just basically say whatever it is you want to hear. So do be careful, exercise caution. But also you have stated that you're totally cool if they want to keep things purely physical. So just say, look, I want you to be real with me. If this is just purely physical and you're after me for my money, yeah, cool, whatever. But I want to know if you actually have feelings for me before I pour my heart out, you know, yeah, that kind of thing. So usually, right, this is how I imagine I'm going to be like as a dad. So you can expect me one day to be looking in the eye of any guy trying to get with my daughters or any guy trying to get with my son. If he turns out gay, I'd be like, hey, what are your intentions for my child? And usually they, like, they, they crumble. They break and crumble like cookies when you dip them in tea. Oh, Just be straight up and ask. But going back to the whole gold digger thing, which you didn't say, but I'm because he said you're sugar daddy. If you get a feeling that they're saying whatever it is you want to hear, then you can be like, oh, okay, cool. So you actually love me not for my money. All right, cool. Because cool, great. Yeah, next time uh, we're going to go halves and let's see how she reacts, you know, and test her. Or you can get even more creative, like maybe hire a dude and just tell her like, yo, this guy is like super loaded and stuff. Ah, he's richer than I am. And let's see, see if she goes for that guy. If you do, then you think, oh, okay. You're right. Yeah, you can get really creative with this stuff. But going down to the base of all of it, I would just say communicate it effectively. Just tell her what it is you want out of the relationship. If it's commitment, then you'd let her know. And hopefully she's on that same wavelength and she'll also want commitment. Other than that, if you don't want this kind of lifestyle to continue where you're being used for your money, I would say probably stop going for those little girls. But if you want to do away with this kind of lifestyle where you are always in a position where you're a sugar daddy, then I'm afraid you need to make some changes because uh, the definition of this insanity is pretty much doing the same thing over and over again expecting different results every time so if you keep doing the same thing you're obviously going to get the same outcome so change things up maybe try an app and make it so the age range is higher i don't know i mean gold diggers come in all ages all shapes and sizes sugar daddies too i don't know it's one of those positions where i don't think i'm ever going to be in your be there because to be a sugar daddy gotta have that money which which i don't sorry so that's all i have to say so if there's anything else that people want to add if they also have similar experiences Experiences to that or maybe you are a gold digger or you are a sugar daddy in need or something like that We don't need to judge just feel free to comment just do whatever you want do give some advice because I can only provide one perspective So with that being said if you enjoyed what you watch, please do consider subscribing if you haven't already Do click on the notification bell so you're kept up to date whenever I upload new videos What else is there? Please do like share and comment because it really does help the video out and you can also catch me live on stream on twitch twitch.tv forward slash ask who you mic there you can catch me playing games you can also go in the chat, maybe ask me some questions there live, or just have me in the background as you're working from home, or just hang out and have a good time. And lastly, as always, these emails are kept anonymous, so please feel free to send in any questions, confessions, or anything you want to get off of your chest to the email in the description below. So with that being said, I look forward to your next email, and I will see you in the next video. See ya!